Odex empowers customers with effortless invoice tracking and seamless payment information updates. This user guide explains the step-by-step -step process of blanket delegation. Blanket delegation feature refers to the act of granting authority over a wide range of period instead of assigning specific shipment individually. Blanket delegation eliminates the task of submitting the authority letter by the agents for each shipment, which results in efficient handling of shipment. The consignee or shipper will log on to odex at online.odexglobal.com. To initiate the blanket delegation process, the consignee or shipper should select the standing instruction option by clicking on the toggle navigation option. Upon clicking on the standing instruction tab, the consignee or shipper can submit the delegation request by clicking on the instruct icon. On clicking the instruct icon, the blanket delegation option will be available in the drop-down. Once the blanket delegation option is selected, it will allow the consignee or shipper to input details such as port details POA, POL, POD and destination, valid from date. Please note that the system will automatically capture the next date. However, manual adjustments can be made for future date selection, if necessary, valid till date. Moving forward, the consignee or shipper has to select the invoices for which they wish to grant access to the agent. This may include credit note, freight invoice, time pending invoice, ancillary landside invoice depending upon the region, company UEN, tax ID, via TID, and SSM depending upon the region is a mandatory information which has to be updated in order to proceed further. Upon entering the company UEN, tax ID, via TID, an SSM, other details such as company name, address, and email address will get auto-populated. Finally, after verifying all the information, please click on Accept Terms and Conditions, if applicable, and click on the Submit button to submit the request on ODEX. Important note. 1. Blanket delegation request is allowed at port level as well as country level. 2. While updating the port details, if there are multiple delegation requests, exact match will be given high priority. For example, if the POD is USNYC, Customer 1 has updated the POD as US and Customer 2 updates the POD as USNYC. Customer 2 will get a high priority because of the exact match. 3. Validity date available on blanket delegation screen is representing the BL release in ODEX. A pop-up will appear on the screen confirming the request is submitted successfully once the request is submitted by the consignee or shipper to the agent. Upon submission of a request by the consignee or shipper, the agent will receive an email notification. The agent can then log into ODEX and proceed to action on the received request. If you wish to cancel the blanket delegation, click on the hyperlink of the created event to open the information on the delegation request submitted. Then, click the Cancel Delegation button to proceed. After clicking the Cancel Delegation button, a successful cancellation pop-up will appear confirming that the instruction is cancelled successfully. This completes the end-to-end -end process of blanket delegation request by the consignee or shipper to the agent.